Peterborough United season has been nothing if not eventful. They opened the campaign with three wins and then three defeats. Now they bounce back from four straight losses with five victories in a row. Will that inconsistency ultimately cost them an automatic promotion place? Well, a win against the league leaders would certainly keep the dream alive. Portsmouth arrive here five points clear at the top of the pile. They've lost just two of their last 25 away league games. But they've also lost their last three visits to London Road. Well, Darren Ferguson saying his side found a way to win against Stephen Inch. He says they weren't at their normal standards. Three goals from four attempts on target in the match. As they look to build something early. De Havilland in the side today. Now Katonga. It's a nice ball into the box. The acrobatics from Villasil off target. Well, some encouragement for the home faithful. Portsmouth arriving here, unbeaten in 11 in League One. They have been relentless in their pursuit of championship football next season. So they try and work something here. It's lifted towards the top corner. Fit Harris. Has got that in his locker. And he was offered the space to make the attempt. Just couldn't quite execute it. John Lucinio, the uh, Portsmouth boss, saying it's healthy for his players to be excited about what they could achieve this season. It'd be life changing to return to the championship for many of these players, and they've won a free kick. Just a bit of holding from Collins. Pack lining this one up then. Over the wall. And difficult for the keeper to hold. Steer doing just enough there. Well, the closest Portsmouth have come. And also, the foot of the keeper didn't matter. Steer to get Peterborough moving then from the back. They've scored in every home game they've played so far, Peterborough this season. And they've won it back fairly here. And now scampering forward. It's a good strike. Well, Burroughs had Portsmouth worried. As he takes this on. He's just invited forward into the penalty area, nearly punishes the league leaders. Still skewing this one towards Gatonga. It's a nice play and it's uh, spread nicely as well. Mason Clark doing what he likes to do, run at defenders. Oh! Well, he's rattled the underside of the woodwork. You don't much, come much closer than that. Bit of space to work with. And as he takes this on, bamboozling the defender, beating the goalkeeper, but not the woodwork. Oh, cool. Bring in Peterborough's step at the moment towards the end of this first half. As it's lifted towards the box once more. Randall. Can you find a teammate? Collins, first time. Mason Clark. Side netting. Well, Portsmouth have certainly not had all this their own way. They are being made to work hard here. Boku. It's a poor ball. And Pat picks it up. 
Rather than winning it back. No foul. Collins helps it up. Here's Randall. Mason Clark once more. Another chance to run the defence. And Norris down well here to deny his former teammate. Spent a few months on loan at the back end of last season. Keeps Peaceborough at bay. Well, Portsmouth have had to survive a few chances from the home side. They've kept clean sheets in 12 of 19 away games. It is a remarkable defensive record. This is a meeting between League One's top scorers and the division's best defence, and it's so far Peterborough asking the questions and going close again through Mothersill. Kitongo. Exchanging passes, getting himself to the byline. It's a nice cutback, and it's almost squeezed in at the far post. Nice touch from De Havilland. Gets it back. Good football once more from the home side. Randall into the box now. Poku trying to turn, has to take it away from goal. Gets it towards the box again, but this time it's the visitors who, well, I was going to say, get away. They've lost it once more. Randall. Burrows. Well, it was an inviting cross. And there's a bit of afters as well. well. We'll come on to the afters with Sparks and Poku in a minute, but it was yearning to be placed into the net. Mason Clark, still Peterborough trying to unlock the door. Randall to Harland. Times Peterborough camped outside the Portsmouth box. They've not been able to make anything of it this time, and there could be a break up. It's White. Lifts it out to another substitute, Yangi. Into the area, still going! And it's the league leaders in front. With 12 minutes to go. Well, they've had to do plenty of defensive work, Portsmouth. But this is just how dangerous they can be on the counter-attack. White helping it on to Yengi. And immediately he had eyes on his third goal in a week. Brilliant finish. Pompey in front. Well, those 4,000 travelling fans enjoying every minute of this now. Referee looks at his watch, and it is a big, big win for Portsmouth, who stay five points clear at the top. They're also nine above the playoffs now. Yengi, the difference maker from the bench, as Pompey put another foot forward. On their journey back to the championship, results elsewhere mean Peterborough have seven points to make up on second place. It's not impossible, but for Posh, the playoffs now look probable. Their five match winning run comes to an end. It's those 4,000 travelling fans who can celebrate yet more success on the road. <laughs>